Hello students, now we are going to discuss about the technical documents required for the export of pharmaceutical from India, right? So to export uh, in last class also we have discussed that what are the uh, requirements for the export of pharmaceuticals, whatever the drug products, medicine, if you want to export to other country, maybe in Asia, maybe in European country or any other uh, UK, US, Australia, whatever the country may be. So what are the basic documentation that is required for the manufacturer or for the seller who want to export the pharmaceutical product? So let's discuss, right? So the topic, it is the technical documentation or technical documents for export of pharmaceuticals or medicine or drug product right so the these are the 10 basic uh, uh, documents which is compulsory required the first one is the company pan number right pan number means permanent account number for the financial details uh, if the particular uh, income tax department or the particular export department if they want to know because it is very much important that what is the financial status of the particular manufacturer that they should know right the second one is the incorporation certificate right registered business document right whether the particular uh, company or a particular seller or manufacturer it is registered or not right incorporation certificate whether it is having or not that is very important then only further it can be uh, proceed or think right the third document which is very much important that is the bank statement bank account statement and other financial documents like for credit and debit details for all form right whatever the what is the uh, uh, how much amount has been credited into that particular account which is registered as a which is opened in the name of the company and how much has been debited what is the kinds of financial transactions it is going on with that particular uh, manufacturing company or the particular company which has been registered or want to export the drug that also it is very important even for visa a small visa also if you apply to any country they are asking the six month bank statement right so this is very important that to know the financial status of the individuals fourth one banker certificate and other customs document right by bank officials uh, how much money company has right so it will be given what is the turnover how much money it is in fd or uh, with the company it is having as a uh, uh, asset right so so that it can have the uh, uh, one prediction can have by the particular uh, author authority organization that uh, uh, what is the status whether it is good company or not because financial financial background it's everything for the any organization of course right so the the fifth one it is the iec number what is iec number we have discussed in last class also import export code number right so that's very important the particular code number it will be issued by the uh, uh, particular authority authorization uh, body uh, with that code uh, the particular product can go and it can come by the particular manufacturer or particular company right so import export code number it is very important especially when we are exporting the exporting and importing any pharmaceutical or any goods right then sixth one indian trade classification of the product which you want to sell to outside of the country what is the trade classification category of pharmaceutical solid doses from liquid doses from anti-diabetic anti-inflammatory in that classification trade uh, trade classification already it is having the long list in that which category it is coming off right so that also uh, that certificate also supposed to be attached then seventh one proof of ownership of business what is the proof that it is your product right or you it is your business even you know public know everybody know but why where it should be in the documentation right so the trade license whether we are having or not registration with the state government right if you open a small shop you want if in if a small general store also you need to take the permission from written permission from the municipal corporation of your particular location so like that uh, what is the registration certification with the government that this is your company this is your ownership it comes under that document also it is required when you are going for export then cancel the check eighth one it cancelled the check whatever the check cancelled along with the check number that also has to be revealed that these during the period of six months or during the period of one year this many check has been written and issued but because of xyz reason this has been cancelled so what is the frequency of cancelling the check and what are what are the basic reason basically the exporting authority they want to know 
राइट देन नाइन्थ वन डब्ल्यू एच ओ जी एम पी सर्टिफिकेशन वर्ल्ड हेल्थ ऑर्गेनाइजेशन इज गिविंग द गुड मैन्युफैक्चरिंग प्रैक्टिस सर्टिफिकेट गुड मैन्युफैक्चरिंग प्रैक्टिस सर्टिफिकेट अपटेंड और नॉट बिकॉज वेन एवर यू आर मैन्युफैक्चरिंग दैट पर्टिकुलर फार्मास्यूटिकल प्रोडक्ट इन टू द फार्मास्यूटिकल इंडस्ट्री वैदर यू आर मेंटेनिंग द गुड मैन्युफैक्चरिंग प्रैक्टिस और नॉट राइट फ्रॉम द द वॉटर द स्पेस प्रोवाइडेड द सेंट्रिफिक सेंट्रिफ वॉट यू कॉल स्टेलाइजेशन द फ्यूमिगेशन वॉट इज द एयर वेंटिलेशन ह्यूमिडिटी टेम्परेचर कंट्रोल देर आर लॉन्ग लिस्ट ऑफ पैरामीटर फॉर जी एम पी वेदर यू आर मेंटेन यू हैव मेंटेन्ड और नॉट ड्यूरिंग द प्रोडक्शन ऑफ दैट पर्टिकुलर प्रोडक्ट दैट ऑल्सो नीड टू हैव देन टेंथ वन डोजेयर कंटेनिंग फॉलोइंग डिटेल्स वॉट एवर द योर प्रोडक्ट इट इज हैविंग वॉट आर द डिटेल्स अबाउट दैट प्रोडक्ट अल्टीमेटली द प्रोडक्ट ओनली इट इज दी इन द लीड रोल वेन यू आर एक्सपोर्टिंग राइट वॉट इज इट इज दैट ऑल्सो द डिटेल ऑल्सो शुड बी रिवील लाइक प्रोडक्ट डिटेल्स अप्रूव्ड जेनेरिक नंबर इफ इट इज जेनेरिक प्रोडक्ट वॉट इज द नंबर बिकॉज नंबर विल से एवरीथिंग इट विल बी यूनिक आइडेंटिफिकेशन नंबर फॉर ईच एंड एवरी प्रोसीडिंग्स विच इज नॉट गोइंग टू मैच विद अदर दैट्स वॉट दिस काइंड ऑफ डॉक्यूमेंटेशन दैट्स वॉट स्ट्रेंथ अपर डोज वॉट इज द स्ट्रेंथ पर डोज लाइक राइट इफ यूर इट इज ए टैबलेट सो वॉट इज द टैबलेट टू फिफ्टी एम जी फाइव हंड्रेड एम जी सेवन फिफ्टी वॉट इज द राइट डोजेस फॉर्म सॉलिड डोजेस फॉर्म लिक्विड डोजेस फॉर्म गैस और पैरेंट्रल वॉट एवर इट इज राइट विजुअल डिस्क्रिप्शन वॉट आर द सपोज टू बी देयर प्रिस्क्राइब अंडर रजिस्टर्ड प्रैक्टिशनर ओनली और शेड्यूल एच और विच शेड्यूल ऑफ द ड्रग इट इज राइट पैकिंग डिटेल्स वॉट आर द मटेरियल हैज बिन एल्यूमिनियम फॉइल और वॉट आर द प्लास्टिक्स वॉट आर द थिंग्स हैज बिन यूज वेदर इट इज हैविंग एनी इंटरेक्शन विद दी ड्रग कंटेन और ड्रग मॉलिक्यूल्स ऑल दोज थिंग्स ऑल्सो लिस्ट ऑफ द कंट्रीज विच द प्रोडक्ट हैज बीन आइदर अप्रूव्ड रिजेक्टेड और विदड्रॉन because it is possible that whenever you have applied for the export registration uh, you may have uh, approved uh, for the australia uk canada singapore malaysia you may be rejected also the particular pharmaceutical company it has been rejected because of the xyz reason that also has to be revealed or withdrawn after certain period for one year it has been approved after one year it is going to expire so those details are also supposed to be revealed list of active pharmaceutical ingredients so what are the active ingredient it is being used in your product that also list should be revealed stability testing all the, all the physical stability chemical stability biological those testing has been done or not if it has been done which method has been Used those things also in efficacy and safety parameter of that particular pharmaceutical product, which the particular pharmaceutical company want to export. That also has to be revealed there, so that it can be. If this all the technical documents documentation has to be submitted for the export or to the particular like uh, uh, what 